I spent 200 days on the ice sheet in RimWorld. Rim Can I continue surviving, recruit new colonists to help around the base, and defend the base against more raids? I'm playing on the hardest difficulty. Welcome back to 100 days on the ice sheet here, where we last left off. We built this whole base here. We just need to, yeah, work on getting recruits and such, so we will focus. On silver, we need more steel to reconstruct the spike traps. Toxic fallout from Randy Random. Well, then the snow continues to fall as silver continues to mine in this toxic fallout. I need all of this steel for the high-tech research bench. I'm going to place it right here. I'm going to deconstruct this structure for steel and marble. This is very nice. Exotic goods trader. They had 26 components, so that's all I'm buying. Meteorite of sandstone from Randy. And uh, I should probably become a mechanitor, but... Yeah, I need a crafter. Transpod crash with squint. Uh, if it wasn't for Pyromaniac, I probably would have uh, gotten him. Oh, he got off. The worst of the toxic fallout has settled, finally. Yax, join. Two of them, which will die. Geothermal power. Yep, that is very nice. We're going to go for advanced lights. Slave ship. Hopefully this time they will have actual human adult slaves. Mm, I don't think these are any good slaves, unfortunately. This is what I'm trading. We also got a war merchant. This is all that I'm trading. Now a bulk goods trader. Well then, this is what I'm trading. With that cloth, I can make maybe poker table. Maybe make a billiards table. Got the high-tech research bench now. Getting the sterile materials down. Raid from wasters. Let's kill this humongous among us guy. They should all be fleeing soon. There they go. Let me see if I can organ harvest these people. Two organ donors, welcome. Got all the organs out of humongous among us. I'm going to go for Wiggy. Infestation. Ah, yeah, two of them. Let's see here. Two mega spiders, two spillilopedes, and uh, one mega scarab. And all the organs, or I think we only got the lung and liver out of Wiggy. Let me take care of these before they reproduce. Rare thrombos. Ah, I can do the trick once more. Let me try to grenade these insects. Ah, uh, that should be good enough. Now I really need the spike traps to kill them all. Oh, yes, yes, this is very good. Only two left. Oh, yes, the Spillilopede is the only one left, I think. Also got a Mega Scarab. There we go. The hives have been dealt with, all thanks to the spike traps. Well, peace upon the cold grounds once again. And a psychic zoo from Randy. Oh, I forgot the thrombos. Yeah, I need to uh, make sure they get into the heat box. Another slave ship. I think it's because, uh, yeah, we're getting later into the game here with only one colonist. So Randy is trying to send me some pawns. If they are good, I mean, look at this. This is bad. This second slave is also bad. They cannot even do combat. And the uh, third slave is a literal child. This is all that I'm trading. Visitors to trade. Oh no, the visitor is leaving because of dangerous temperature. It's only minus 19. So I have got the thrombo food here. I have everything set up, so let's burn the thrombos. One of them is moving already. Hopefully this one will uh, try to eat the food. Oh no, uh, the thrombo strat isn't working. Here we go. It's moving somewhere. Where are you going? Where the hell is this thing going? Oh, that thing just ignored us. A few days later, we got the high-tech research bench constructed. We got the billiards table. I'm going to work on an electric smelter and a machining table. Advanced lights. I think it's time to go for maybe shields, deep drilling. You know what? We need to focus on getting babies and such. So growth vats. We will uh, try to get some people, some prisoners to extract their uh, special liquid fluid. The white one. Arctic wolf hunting silver. It looks like we will make it back inside. Transpod crash. Pyromaniac, as always. 
There we go, dead wolf. And with the base cleaned up, we're going to continue researching, getting kids. Our wealth is at 38,000, quite low. Got growth vats, fertility procedures it is, and yeah, just continue looking for people. Raid from the mech hive. Let's see here, two centipedes. What? One cipher, two ciphers, that's it. Yeah, Randy Random being nice and gentle with me. Fertility procedures, I think I'm going to go for biofuel refining. It is also 14 Celsius outside, nice and warm. And got one of them, but this cipher right here is being quite annoying. It is just dead now. There we go, three components on that thing. Royal Tribute Collector and Ducks join. Uh, I do not need these ducks. We will release them. Cargo pods with smoke leaf from Randy. Biofuel refining. Let's go for mortars, actually. We're going to need it for our first siege. Rare thrombos. Hello. Groups of visitors to trade once more. This is all that I'm trading. Silver ore meteorite from Randy. Thrombos are moving out of the map. Looks like we're too late. Transport crash from the empire oh she got up let's see here so this thrombo right here is starving malnutrition oh my it's going for the rice uh let's see if we can do this come on yep it is it is going to die now well that was uh, quite good also got mortars i think i'll research outer doors getting deep drilling and ground penetrating scanner would be quite decent too outer doors already let's get shields uh, going to go for blowback operation maybe try to get some assault rifles blowback operation get gas operation going to mine some more steel for the future gas operation time for precision rifling yeah quite a slow start still no uh no more Pawns other than silver. Exotic goods trader. This is all that I'm trading. Transport crash. Hmm, she is silver sister. Uh, undergrounder industrious volatile. I mean, she's quite all right. Construction mining plants. Let's just rescue her. And if she joins, then she joins. Last joins. Welcome. I would like to convert her first. For our settlement and faction name, it will be Golden Sheet. A uh, food binge on silver. Oh no, you're going to make her bleed out. Uh, silver. Oh Jesus, you almost let her die. Welcome aboard, sacred. You know what? I'm just going to toss her into a growth vat after we've converted her because, well, he's only 16. And if you don't know, uh, global work speed here is, yeah, 9% off. So we need to, yeah, grow her. Going to place down a growth vat right there. Precision rifling. Yeah, let me go for multi analyzer. Maybe deep drilling first. Oh my, a hundred to 51% in one stroke. I think it's because of this volatile trait. Yeah. Man on your pack. Bunch of huskies. I do not want them triggering the trap, so we're just going to block up. Oh, a bunch of visitors were passing by. Nice free food. Already converted sacred. Let's release her and start growing her. Ah, sacred and silver. The two sisters right next to each other. So I think now that we have one more recruit, we need one more and we will start to construct these hydroponics deep drilling go for ground penetrating scanner infestation oh not again but it's only two of them this time three spillopedes three mega scarabs and one mega spider well let us deal with this they are fleeing the insects uh, instead of attacking us that is weird now they seem to be attacking us run silver Here we go, just a few of them. Come on, just die already. There we go. Oh no, how did I not see that? Well, that was close. All goods trader as well. Tantrum Silver. <laughs> what are you doing, Silver? Uh, yeah, that is not good. This is all that I'm trading. I'm also going to make Sacred Leader and Silver the Moral Guide, so let's do this. Another slave ship. Hmm, I mean, there is this Edakin here. She is quite alright, but she doesn't have any good skills. We got Ground Penetrating Scanner. Let's go for maybe hospital beds. I'm also going to use grenades to destroy all of this clothing. Unnecessary wealth. Unnecessary wealth. 
We also have Sacred to go back into the growth vat. We had bio starvation here, which is very bad. Need to fill that. Hospital beds. I'm going to expand our little uh, hospital room here. Hospital slash research room. I'm going to make maybe two hospital beds for now. Oh, finally, raid from imps. They're attacking immediately. Okay. Well, in silver, hopefully we can get some good imps. We will see. We got this guy who has mining double passion, art double passion, and this female who has cooking and mining. Why are they not coming for me? Combat supplier as well. Hmm, one group is fleeing. Oh, we got Morat here. I really need Zeros right here. Yes, uh, he's even better. Oh, he got downed. Let us tend to these two people. I will have to tend to them with normal medicine. They are really important. Here we go. Managed to save both of them. Oh, 27 resistance on one of them. Infection, no. Argo pods from Randy with fine meals. And Sacred is already 18 years old. She has already grown up. Argo pods from Randy now with Flake. Wow, Berserk. I would also like to pile up some ovums from Silver and Sacred. Yes, for future kids. Sadistic Rage on Sacred. Yeah, this volatile trade is a bit annoying. So these people have high life missing. So I think I'm just going to uh, get some flake in them so they don't stay so sad. Here we go. Yup, high life. They are getting happy. Medium Psychic Drone. That's uh, quite bad, actually. Jailbreaker. No. Not my advanced components. Well then, they seem to be fine. Yeah, just having a nice nutrient paste meal in the middle of it all. An Aurora and another slave ship. No good slaves. This is what I'm trading. So now that we have almost four colonists, we're mining more steel. I will construct these hydroponics here. It is minus 52 Celsius. We're getting hypothermia. Berserk zeros and a combat supplier. This is what I'm trading with the combat supplier. Raid from the mech hive. All of these should die to the spike traps, I hope. Yeah. Transport crash. Let's see here. No crafting. You're useless. Link self tame as well. Well then come and help us out. Yeah, the spike traps are just destroying them. There we go. Meteorite of compacted steel. That's actually very good. Well then, half of our hydroponics layout is completed. The shuriken one. New recruit. Yeah, we have recruited and converted her, so let's rename her. Welcome aboard, Dragon Ruby. You will do crafting, cooking, maybe mining. Speaking of which, we could probably become a mechanitor now because uh, Dragon Ruby is a good craftsman. I'm also going to make silver the moral guide. Ooh, no more power. I'm also going to construct a geothermal power plant. Hmm, they are quite far away from the base, though. I will go for this one. Silver or meteorite again. I'm also going to make uranium simple helmets for everyone. Very protective. Oh, I really need this geothermal generator. We also recruited Zeros. Welcome aboard, Jeremy. You will be a miner, cooker, and an artister. I mean, an artist. Right after jail, Jeremy is throwing a party. Yeah, we have come quite a far away. What I'm also going to have Jeremy do is fertilize all of these ovums. So I got this gene here from Sacred and Jeremy. I think this one is pretty good. Very fast runner. Now we are running out of food, so we will have to grow some rice. But as you can see, all the hydroponics are done. Silver has also constructed a geothermal generator. I'm going to mine all this silver on the map and start making some sculptures. Polar bear hunting silver. Oh, we need to kill that thing. Oh, I forgot to destroy this Exostrider. I guess I should do it now. So the next step I want to do is get a kill box up. I'm thinking the singularity because our wealth is, yeah, going up quite a lot and we still don't have one. Going to need a few granite blocks. I'm also going to get a kitchen down since we have two cooks in the colony now. James Cook. Here we go, Exostrider. Oh, serious hypothermia on Dragon Ruby. Yeah, these imps are very, very fragile towards the cold. Jeremy is also inserting this embryo now. 
It's time to grow the kids. Oh, he has put some human meat in there. This child will truly be what they eat. I also got an electric stove up now. We can start cooking. Here we go. So I've set up for fine meals. Let's go. I'm going to have Silver decrypt this transporter here and we will do this quest. Dragon Ruby just shooting them all. Please do not destroy my wind turbine. Well then, only one left. Extract the mech link and we are ready to become a mechanitor. Infection on Dragon Ruby, never good. I'm going to continue researching now. Maybe I'll go for hmm, multi analyzer. Yeah. I'm also going to make an ideology room. So where do I do that? Here we go. The kill box has been planned out. It is going to take a bit of resources to construct, but we really need more defensive systems than a spike trap corridor. We are slowly running out of food, <laughs> but I think 20 24 hydroponics full of rice can support four colonists. New quest, emergency landing. I think I actually want honor this playthrough, so who do we do it for? I think Dragon Ruby could be a good sidecaster. Here we go, hopefully they will win this. Here is the raid. Oh no, those pigs will 100% uh, win. I'm also going to have Dragon install the mech link. And we will get our Constructoid. Man Hunter pack. Ooh, bunch of panthers. Stay inside. Well then, since we have the mech link, I'm going to research basic mech tech up to standard mech tech. Basic mech tech done. I will need to construct everything for it. Got the plague on two people. Ooh, a slave ship. This is all that I'm trading. I'm going to make the workshop in here and have all my mechanitor stuff. Jeremy is also working on a Jade Grand sculpture. That thing will really drive up the impressiveness. Ooh, the Singularity kill box is finally up. And healthy vat birth. Well then, welcome aboard, QT Sensei. You will be great, but you will go into the growth fat until you're three years old. Ah, uh, look at Jeremy the dad feeding baby food to little QT Sensei. I wanted to grow QT Sensei in the growth vat, but yeah, she has bio starvation. Also going to do a few rituals, want to reform our ideology. I'm going to need a lot more steel for future projects, like flooring this whole thing in. Here we go, we have everything ready for the new biotech stuff. We're going to go for, we have a cons- no, we need an agri hand and maybe clean sweeper. Well, the colony is really thriving now, production. I would also like to make chain shotguns for the kill box, so I think I'll have Dragon Ruby do that. Maybe make one, two chain shotguns. Well, I can finally deconstruct this spike trap corridor. We still do not have enough power. Oh my, this was cut off the entire time. I will probably have to strip mine now since there's no steel on the surface. Look at that. A good jade grand sculpture. I'm also going to continue researching multi analyzer and then I will summon Diabolus for standard mech tech. We also got the agri hand here. Now that we have mechs, we have to deal with toxic waste packs, which will be, yeah, I mean, I will just throw it into nature. That's what we humans do anyways. Another Manhunter pack. I've also researched gun turrets just in case. We go for multi analyzer. Oh, we got plasteel already and steel. Got a clean sweeper as well. QT Sensei became a child. We will have you do mining in the future. Oh, I forgot. I need some clothing for little QT Sensei. Oh, we got some jade. But I'm looking for components. The huskies are gone. We can finally go outside. I forgot. I need some learning things for the kids. Look at this. Silver and QT Sensei just learning together. Anyways, it has been good, but it has been 200 days here in Rim World. I mean, yeah, sacred silver Jeremy just mining out the mountain. We are rapidly expanding our base. Anyways, if you want to continue on the safe, I'll be consider becoming a Patreon member. Anyways, thanks to my Patreon members, and if you're bored, then watch this video next.